And I was like, ooh, that's so, so pretty. And then I saw the swatches and I was like, that's six shades of pink. Well, hello, my lovely Neslings, and welcome to another new makeup releases. Mm, yes, I'm excited. I have some very, very fun things to talk about today. At least, I think. It yeah, and if you are new, welcome. My name is Nikki. I'm 45 from the Netherlands, hence the accent. And if you love makeup commentary, if you want to know what's new and hip in the beauty community, or at least in the makeup community, can you then tell me so I know as well? Just saying, if you want, <laughs> if you want to be entertained, if you want to be inspired by unusual color combinations, and if you are slightly orcish, like me then this is the channel for you subscribe become part of my nestlings because we are having a blast here on the internet yes before we go any further can i just make an announcement of course i can because it's my channel it's my video i have also made a vlog channel uh it will it's listed down below in the description box in case you are interested in i don't know hearing more about my life and a little bit randomly and such this video series is based on Samantha March's Will I Buy It series. Her playlist and the community playlist are in the description box as well. Uh, the sources, my sources are there. There are discount codes there and the products that I will mention today. Or at least the brands are listed because I have some sneak peeks as well. Yes, this I didn't film. I, it just happened this morning. Yes, uh, I hope that Instagram kind of wants to play nice because we were having... Um, Errors or all day, but yeah, let me go to the side like so. Recline, be fabulous. Hope my hands don't freeze off because it's cold here. But yeah, what can you do about it? Before, just before I sat down to film, I saw this, and this is from Kaleidos. And I am guessing that they are coming out with a new collection. I don't know, Poison Apple, Halloween -y. I see some DNA strands, I see. Uh, the Apple collection. Editing me here. Uh, with breaking news. Because I know what the Kaleidos collection entails. I have the picture up on my computer now. So let me go to the side a little bit. So I can put the picture up there. Uh, basically it is eight new lip clays. And the bundle will retail for 89 the collection, full collection will retail for 89 bucks. It will include eight new shades of the lip clays, a new lip mask, an ornament stone, and a fan. I love the packaging. Again, those tin packaging, they're so, so pretty. Now, I don't really know. I think looking at the picture that I have here, maybe it's like one bundle more funky colors and the other bundle more wearable colors, if you will. Uh, maybe a little bit more cool toned even. The uh, lip clay formula is amazing. It is one of my favorite liquid lipstick formulas. It is like putting velvet on your lips. It's such a unique experience. It's not drying at all, for me at least. Uh, and their lip, their lip mask that I have from their Flower Punk collection is very nice to use underneath their liquid lipstick as well. Because it is... Um, it's a formula that hydrates but sinks in as well. Um... Yeah, that's it. So how do I combine them? I do the lip mask on my lips when I'm going to apply everything. And then when I am done, I kind of blot off the excess and put on the lip clay if I want to. Now you can get a very feathered effect if you just use lip clay uh, on its own. And if you use a lip liner, you can get a little bit more of a preciser line, if you will. Um, the formula is very, very comfortable to wear. So yeah, I am. I'm very interested to see the colors because i do have some colors that i saw here and i saw a red i saw a dark i think a dark purple uh, and some cool toned more brown shades yeah so um i also know when it will drop it will drop uh, september the 9th at 8 p.m pst or pdt one of the one or the other so that's specific standard time i believe um, I've also looked it up for me, uh, Central European Summertime, uh, and it is then the 10th at 5 a.m. If you are in uh, the UK, because that sh it showed me the UK as well, because apparently I have been looking up UK time a lot as well, then you are at 4 a.m. the 10th. Am I going to set my alarm? No. Uh, I No, I won't. Uh, I remember with the last uh, collection that they had, 
when I went to order, stuff was selling out constantly, but it was also being restocked constantly. So I'm just going to... Um, yeah, not set my alarm, but I do want this collection, or at least part of the... Do I want the fan? I don't know. I kind of like it. The apple stone. It kind of depends on how the stone is looking, because on the picture I see basically a white ornamental stone. Maybe you can paint it. Maybe it's something like that. I don't know. I kind of want to see a little bit more, and I really want to see the, the, the colors that are in the sets. But the tins, again, oh, just for... Honestly, just for the tins. I'm just a sucker for packaging. What can I say? So yeah, that was that was what I know from Kaleidos. If you want to know uh, people getting it in PR, search YouTube for it because I'm I'm sure people are getting this in PR. Unfortunately, I'm not one of them. Maybe one day I will be. I'm just going to manifest it. One day I will be on their PR list as well. So that was it. Um, I'm going to let you go now back to my past self and enjoy the rest of the video. Yes. Next. I'm going to go to a brand that I uh, had never heard of, that I was tagged in by one of you. And thank you so very, very much for this, because this is just very, very interesting. This is uh, R2R Formula. The, this is a brand in New York. I knew I followed them. Oh, yeah, see, Instagram was being a bitch. Um, they are based in New York. They're very, very small, so they just started. Uh, it says here, all-in-one velvet paint. Choose from 45 colors and experiment for the best results, because there are no rules. These creamy build um, this creamy buildable formula also works on both bare skin or makeup, so can be used as creative as possible before it dries matte. So basically, these are eye safe, these are lip safe, so you can use them on your eyes, on your lips, on your cheeks, whatever. Now, I'm not a single eyeshadow type of person per se, but I do really like this because you can be so, so creative with this. Yeah. You can also use them as eyeliner. I will leave the site down below. Go check them out. Okay, so let's go to another new brand for me, which is Pink Crush Cosmetics. Um, I have two things. So let's start with the fact that they are go go going to come out with a Halloween palette. I don't know what it is just yet, but I will keep you updated. This is all I know. The Witch Please uh, by Pink Crush Cosmetics. I'm very, very interested. Very interested. The next thing that I have from them that makes me extra interested to see what's in the Witch Please palette is their Metamorphosis palette. This has launched already. It is a collaboration with um, Chris Therese Makeup or Krista Rice Makeup. I, I don't know. Let me check. Can I check? Oh, it's Crystal Rice. I'm so sorry. It's Crystal Rice. It's available for purchase now. It really, uh, say it's 30 bucks around that time. Could be a little bit cheaper. Um, but I really like the color story of this. This kind of reminds me a little bit of the, the Beauty Bay Magic Spell palette. It has the same kind of color story. You know, the purple and then the bluey and the minty and the tealy. That kind of thing. Uh, also, BH Cosmetics has kind of something similar. But this is a color story that really works together. I can see gorgeous two-toned looks with these, uh, with this palette. And yeah, as far as I know, there are no glitters in there. Let's see. Um, you get a duochrome, a blue-red purple. Do uh, yeah, blue-red to purple duochrome is in there. Mm, uh, a lavender teal blue flip is in there. No glitter. But very, very pretty mattes and very pretty shimmers. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, and the white that you see is not a white, but it is a purple to blue. I think this looks very, very fun and very pretty. Congratulations uh, on the collab. It looks stunning. Okay. <clears throat> Next. I, I have. Oh yes. Now, if you are new, I am a cruelty-free uh, beauty, YouTube, beauty YouTuber, so usually I don't mention um, mainstream luxury brands because they are not cruelty free. Most of them are not cruelty free. If you do know some that are not cruelty free, that are cruelty free, let me know in the comment section. I can include them then in uh, this video as well. But this, I could not pass this up. So this is from Gucci. 
En it, it looks gorgeous. The component looks gorgeous. And I was like, oh, that's so, so pretty. And then I saw the swatches and I was like, that's six shades of pink. So it's a cushion foundation in basically six shades of pink. Oh no, yeah. And the yellow and, well, kind of a, is it even medium? Yeah, the, yeah. They don't, they don't give a rat's ass, do they? <laughs> because I know that they will get flack for this. I know it because I can see that. But And I see it in the comments as well. They just don't care. Because they are like... Bitch, people are going to buy it anyway. Yeah, that's kind of my... <laughs> it's probably because I filed my nails a little bit more pointy. So And oh yeah, and my brows are very bushy. They are very werewolfy. Halloween mode. So apparently I'm also a little bit bitchy today. I don't even have a bitchy... I, I have bitchy eyebrows. Let's just go with that. Yeah, this... Next. Yes. Next is from Pink Honey UK. Uh, they are sneaking something. And I don't really know what, but they are sneaking something big. Which is going to be revealed Sunday the 5th. Which is tomorrow. For you guys, at least. For me, it's still a few days away. But I am very excited to see what they are releasing. So we will talk about it again next week. But know that I know that they are coming out with something. I have, well, almost seen it. And um, we will chat again next week. Let's next go to this from uh, Charlotte Tilbury. But I also have a different picture, I thought, right? Oh yeah, I also have comparison. So Charlotte Tilbury is coming out with a new eyeshadow palette. And you see the swatches here by Paulina's Makeup. And she has also done comparisons. So I will show you the comparisons as well. Um, between the bottom two, there's not really that much of a difference. The bottom one has a little bit, maybe a little bit more of a pink. The middle one has a little bit more of a blue. But there's not really a lot of difference, is there? Or is it, is it just me? And so the bottom one on the picture is the new one. Uh, I know that there are people who rave about her palettes. Now, I can I understand the layout. And I like the layout, actually, with the three, uh, the three groups that you have. I think it makes it very easy for people to make a look. Um, and it's basically safe enough to kind of venture out into maybe some daring color combinations if this is your vibe then anything you know if you pair then a green with a purple is very very daring now it's daring for a lot of people um <coughs> so i do like that but it really really looks like the other palette as well um yeah basically in the groups of three you get one matte and then two shimmers let me know your thoughts down below it's not It's not specific, or it has never been my uh, color story per se. I do like, when I look at the swatches, I do like the kind of duochrome shades that are in there. I don't know though. You know, if this is your first Charlotte Tilbury palette, I can understand why you, why you would really like it. I, I do kind of like that color story that's in here. Um, I am kind of venturing into a little bit more softer makeup maybe. This is kind of... I really like the way that this looks. This is just a funky eyeliner and some falsies. Honestly, the fun fact is when I saw this, I was like... I'm going to bitch about this palette. And the longer I look at it, the more I'm like... I kind of like this palette. <laughs> Let's just go to the next one. Let's... When I saw this picture, I thought that Colourpop had released new quads. But it's not Colourpop, it's ZC Cosmetics. And this is a post from Madage Beauty London because they have stocked these. So you can get them on zc.com. Uh, and if you're here in Europe, you can get them on Madage Beauty London. I have an, uh, not, it's not an affiliate code, it's a discount code for the Madage Beauty site. It can save you 10%. I don't know if there are a discount codes for ZC Cosmetics. I have no idea, but I will link uh, both down below. And this is the Sweet Treats Galore. Yeah, they look they look pretty. Now, ZC Cosmetics is a Chinese makeup brand. And their uh, eyeshadow aesthetic is pretty soft and light. At least that's how I feel. When I look at these, yeah, I do like them. I like the greeny one. What can I say? Um, it doesn't go very, very deep, though. <laughs> that's what she said. <laughs> Um, but it, oh, 
now I have the blue is more of a gray. So I re I don't really know which picture is accurate though. I know that these are stock pictures from ZZ themselves because I have seen these these from ZZ too. So I don't know if um, how I don't know how deep these go. Because if I swipe and I see the individual palettes, it kind of looks like they are not as dark and dramatic as they are on the first picture. But I do kind of like their color stories. I do kind of like them. Let me know if you are excited. Um, yeah, you have four quads uh, to choose from. Oh, that's actually not a bad price. Uh, each quad is, if you buy them from Madage Beauty, they are £12 each. That's, a, that's not too bad. I actually thought that they would be more expensive. Um... Oh, and you, you, you can use my discount code if you want to. However, you can also use the code OPEN20 to save 20% off of your first order. So it's your, if it is your first time ordering from Madage Beauty, you can now use that code OPEN20. If it's the second time or something, you can still try the code, but you can also use my code. <laughs> yeah, they're fun. I think they, they look cutesy. And uh, this also looked very, very cute. Oh, no. Very, very cutesy. This is from... This is a collaboration between uh, Becky Beauty and Mystical Glamour. This is their Halloween collection collaboration. The collection includes eight shades, but they are all multi-chrome shades. And they're very, very pretty. <laughs> the complete bundle retails for $137.50. And individual shades are, say, 12. Uh, you can use her code Mystical Glamour. I will link it down below um, at checkout. Um, yeah, this is very, very pretty. Stunning. And I know that these types of shades are very expensive to formulate. And that is why this is priced higher. But just look at the way that they are looking, honestly. Uh, they're stunning. What can I say? They're stunning. So if you are in the market for something like this, I will leave it down below. Let's next go to Pout and Shout. Because I don't know if it's still in stock as you're seeing this, but I'm going to mention her again. I mention her from time to time when she's doing something very, very cool. And she has made some eyeshadow singles. These are Halloween eyeshadows. There are two of each shade available in 26mm magnetic pants. She makes everything herself by hand. Usually she, she also upcycles packaging. That is why that is why it's just very, very unique. It's usually it's one of a kind. Um, let's see. They are 100% vegan. Mm, three are fairly intense. Three are sheer and sparkly. Uh, the latter, so the sheer and sparkly ones work best applied onto a tacky primer or with a brush dampened with setting spray or something. Um, yes. Mm. Let's see, what does she want for them? She says, pay according to your means as always. Maybe like three to five pounds for per shade. Or you can give yourself a bundle discount. Uh, I will leave her Instagram down below because you order through DM on Instagram. Uh, you get free UK postage. Uh, and for international postage, you kind of have to ask the going rates. And uh, the going rates from the UK to the mainland are expensive. It's not her fault, it's the post. It's the way that it is because it's shipping is insane right now. Um, but I do really like the colors that she chose. I think it's fun. I think that the color combination is very, very cute. Uh, so basically you have a teal matte and I think a dark brown matte. And, or are they all shimmers? I actually don't know. Maybe they're satin. So maybe just the teal one is then a matte? Looks like fun i actually hope that they are just sold out by the time you are seeing this but i did want to mention her because what she's doing it's just so so cool if you have an instagram account to go follow her just yes okay um i also saw this from juvia's place um and then this is a skin loving mystery box um but but when i went to their site I could only find the Skin Loving Mystery Box. I could not find skincare. So basically, what is this? This is a skin, as I said, I think four times. Skin Loving Mystery Box, retailing for 25 bucks. And in it, you get two brand new uh, skincare products uh, and three mystery makeup products. And the basically, the bundle actually retails for seven bucks. I was kind of thinking about it because I'm very interested to see what's in their skincare but also i was like yeah but there's i'm not really one for mystery 
box is. Honestly. Uh, also, I just uh, ordered new skincare from the UK. Um, and that is, yeah, it, it's not usually something I go for because it's very uh, natural, organic skincare. Um, and usually it it's not really kind of triggering for me, but this was. So... Yeah, let me just let me just let me just mention the brand because I can. Uh, let's see where I have them. Yes, Boomy Natural. So that's where I ordered. They are based in the UK. She makes everything in small batches. I watched the video um, and I will link the video down below if I don't forget from uh, someone that I met in my um, YouTube uh, course. Um, She has her own channel. She's from the UK as well. And she did a video on this brand. And it sounded so nice. So I ordered uh, a, mo a moisturizer which contains, con contains, contains broccoli and very good, you know, very good ingredients. Let me see if I can find it. And no, not the face mask. I also ordered a, an oil. <laughs> I love skincare oils. Let's see. Is this the oil? Yeah, this is the face oil. Uh, so I ordered the face oil and I ordered um, the broccoli broccoli moisturizer i don't know it sounded yummy i needed it there was just something about it i needed it and i will leave the brand down below uh go check them out it's yeah boomy naturals it's just so i don't know what it was they they just they just i just got sucked sucked in i ordered and i will let you know how i like it when i get it i needed a new moisturizer what can i say yeah it's my story and i'm sticking to this Anyway, uh, where was I? Uh, oh yeah, Juvia's place. Um, let me know if you have ordered it. I am kind of low-key interested, but I, I kind of want to know what's in there as well. Because yeah, if it's, I don't know, for instance, very, very fragranced, I don't want it because I don't like it. Uh, I currently am trying to finish up a serum that I bought from a brand that's, uh, in, if you're here in the Netherlands, Bio Dermal. And that brand is kind of known for having very good ingredients. But oh my lord, it, it smells of flour. And mm, not the good kind. Not the kind that I like. So I'm trying not to breathe in the scent while, while I'm applying. <laughs> so yeah, I'm... I'm actually interested to hear your thoughts on this. Yes, apparently my bar brows really make me bitchy today. But we, we are going to go with it. Let's go next to Makeup Maniacs Cosmetics. Because I mentioned their Halloween palette, I think, two weeks ago. Now I have the insight and they are doing more. So um, this, what you see here, is already live. So you have the Boo Thang, or, yeah, Boo Thang palette, which looks very cool. I actually don't know if there are glitters in there, but I really like the color story. I don't mind the bigger pants either. I kind of think it's fun. Um, and then there are also eyeshadow um, bundle. Eyeshadow bundle. Let's see. Promo codes are welcome. That's what they are saying. I think my bestie uh, Liora has a promo code for Makeup Maniacs Cosmetics. I believe it's Liora 10. But I will check and I will link it down below. What were these oh, again? What were these? These are, oh yeah, multi-chrome... Loose pigment she also has. Um, but I also think that she has pressed pigments. I Okay, here I have the palette. Is there... Uh, it retails for 29 bucks. I don't know if there are... I uh, Oh, it looks like no glitter. I really like this color story. Yeah, the orange and the purple. So you basically have your bluer toned purples and you have your... Uh, Pinker toned purples. Um, I am more of the blurple kind of person. I like blurples more than I like the pinker purples. Um, but yeah, it's a color, a color combination that I do really, really love. And I, I don't know. This just makes me think of Halloween. So I think that, that that is very, very cool. Let me know your thoughts down below. Have you ordered it? It drops. It has already launched. I already said that. Let me know your thoughts. Yes. What else do I have? Oh, yes. We have from BH Cosmetics. We have the new palette for uh, September, which is the Sapphire palette. I like it. If you want to know how it performs, go watch Angelica Nickfish because I know that she's, she has this um, ordered at least. Um, 
Yeah, I think it's fun. I think it's fun. I haven't. I don't think I will get it. No, I won't get it. But I do think it's it's fun. I think that they are actually doing a great job with this uh, this collection. Um. Okay. What else? Let me know if you have ordered it. Um. Let's next go to Fenty because she's going to release. Now she already has released in Europe um, a bomb bossy. No, a bomb posse mega palette. Uh, it was spotted in European Sephora stores. The palette is inspired by the brands Cult Classics, Fenty Gloss, uh, Fussy, and Hot Chocolate, or something like that. So, yeah, I like the. I kind of like the neutrally side. I don't. I'm not really. I kind of like the pinkier side as well. But I'm not really into the frosted pinks right now. Um, if it was more peachy, I would. It could very well be that I would have bought it then. Are you excited about this? Now, I have heard some very mixed uh, things about the Snap Shadows. This Magnetic 12 Pan Palette. Yeah, I think it retailed somewhere along the lines of... What was it? 50 bucks? Or 48 euro? I don't know. But it was something like that. Then let me know your thoughts down below. Let's next go to something that I have not seen on the site just yet. Uh, So I don't really know when it's coming, but it's a makeup collaboration between Beauty Bay and Disney. It launches Wednesday the 8th, um, but if you have the Beauty Bay app, you can shop it 24 hours early on Tuesday the 7th. Mm, let me know your thoughts. Are you excited? Are you getting anything? I don't know if I am getting anything, but I think it's fun. Yes, oh, you get a Dumbo, Alice in Wonderland and Jungle Book. The palettes are 8 bucks each. Uh, or for a bundle you pay, say, 23 bucks. Uh, three lip and cheek duos. Um, and then six longwear smudge proof shadow sticks. Collection is vegan and cruelty free. Limited edition. Yeah, let me know your thoughts. I, kinda, I, I do kind of want to see a little bit more maybe. But I think it's fun. Let's go to Colourpop. Because they have released a big palette again. It is the... It's a mood palette. 30 pen full palette. Beautiful full and jewel tones. Um, so these swatches are by Jen Phelps Beauty. Now I did see uh, Amanda's video from Makeup Just For Fun on it as well. She also compare swatched it. It's not something that I am in the market for right now. Uh, also because it's Colourpop. It's a bigger palette. It, by the time it gets to me it's mute. I have enough from Colourpop right now. It's not special enough for me. To get right now. And there are press glitters in there. So yeah. But I think that the color story is very autumn toasty. I don't know. It's it's kind of what I go for this time of year. So yeah. I'm not hating it. Let me know your thoughts though. What what do you think of it? Was that the only thing that I have from Colourpop? Really? Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sick Colourpop? Are you okay? Oh, yeah, okay then. Well, uh, that was apparently the only thing that I had from Colourpop today. Um, let's go quickly to... Oh yeah, let's go to this from Sugar Pill. Because they have... Uh, they are going to release another fun-sized palette. Mm, the fun-sized 2. It's the sequel. And uh, let's see. Nine all-new matte shades. I think the color store is fun. Am I going to get it? I actually don't know. I don't know... Can we get sugar pill here? We can, but not everything. And it usually takes a while. And I have a sugar pill palette here that I haven't tried yet that I want to try first. But I do think this is very, very fun. And if this was something that would come here very quickly, maybe, yeah, maybe I would. It is available uh, Wednesday. The f oh, it's available already. Yes. So it's available already. Let me know if you've ordered it. And if you have, how the quality is. What's this? This was an update for uh, Sigil. Yeah, because the Windrose, the one that has been sold out for quite some time, is being brought back. Or at least coming in stock again. Uh, I don't know when. I think this Sunday. But that's kind of an update. Because I know a lot of you um, were really eyeing that palette. And it, ha it has been sold out. So I will leave the site down below. I will leave where you can find the palette down below. Go keep your eye on it. And it will probably launch Sunday. And then noon um, Moscow time. That is usually when she releases stuff. Okay. Let's next go to... Another Halloween release from a Kinky Hearts Club. This is 
thoughts and prayer palette. It has a holographic shine to it, as well as a large mirror on the inside. 12 shades, dark grayscale color scheme, gold, purple and brown accents. Includes glitter, shimmers and mattes. I really, really like this color story. I detest the glitter, but I really do like this color story. I think this is fun. And I think this is a unique twist on most of the Halloween palettes and releases that we will see right now. I just thought it was fun and I wanted to mention it. Uh, it retails for, say, 28 bucks. It's available now on their website and I will link it down below. What else? Oh yeah, Natasha Denona, the new retro eyeshadow palette. I don't know what to make of this. It has launched already. Um... This is the new retro. Honestly, if I look at the old retro and then this, I don't really, from the picture that I have in front of me, really see, you know, the old retro kind of gives me this vibe, what I'm wearing right now. And, and this is more the rosier tones or something. The burgundy, it's not really my color story, which I'm kind of sad about because I was kind of eyeing her newest Really, one day I would. One day there will be a palette that I'm like, bitch, I need it. So, but this is not it. Uh, this is one of the sixty-five dollar palettes, though. Let me know if you are excited. Have you tried it? Mm, is it available everywhere? Online, yeah, uh, and in most stores, uh, September the 9th. Mm, Australia, New Zealand, sep September the fourteenth, online. S-E-A, is that Singapore? I don't know. But most, most sites have it uh, September the 9th, if you are interested. Yeah, I don't, I, not so much, no. Um, do I know anything more from Nomad? No, it's uh, basic, yeah, it's the halloween -y palette. Um, it's coming soon, I know it's coming my way. And I think it is, maybe it's even author. No, because it's, is it a destination? I'm actually not sure. Because she has here, the world seems full of good men, even if there are monsters in it. And that's, um, uh, that's a phrase from a book from um, Bram Stoker, right? Or is it Mary Shelley? I don't know. But I also see uh, red threads, or is it blood? I'm, I think it's blood. I'm very excited. I, I'm, it's on its way to me. I'm very, very excited. If I know more, as soon as I, I know more, I will let you know. What else do I have? Was that it? Um, no, that was not it. Um, I have also pictures from Makeup Revolution. Last week I mentioned that they were collaborating with the DC Universe. And I have pictures. Honestly, I don't really know what to make of this. I don't dislike the color stories. I think I liked the Batman one. But yeah, that's basically the color story that I really go for right now. I don't know. I kind of I kind of feel that they could have done a lot more. <sighs> yeah, I think that's kind of how I feel. That they could have just done so much more. Yeah, again, the Batman palette. I really like the color story of the Batman palette. But it's... What should they have done? They should have done a dark, grungy, deep... Emo, miserable, black... Dark blue, dark grey, that kind of palette. Instead of that, what they have done. Catwoman, it needed to be more spicy. Um, and then the Joker, yeah, I don't... The Joker, yeah, fine. I, I think that I like that one the best, actually. Um, and then uh, the other one is Harley Quinn, I think is also very, very safe. I think it's a very safe collection. I do like the tin from the Joker, though, with the brushes. I like that. Um, will I get anything? Oh, there's also a bigger eyeshadow palette. Really? I don't know. I kind of like the, the highlight from Catwoman just because it has a cat on it. But that's, that's kind of it. Yeah, I'm, I, I think that they played it too safe. Yeah, honestly. It could have been way worse. Could it? Yeah, it could have. Yeah, it could have been worse, but it also could have been way better. Uh, but you never know. Maybe if I see it on the side, I'm like, I need it. And you never know. But as of yet, yeah, not really.
let's go next to what is this. This is Alien Cosmetics, right? Let me go here. Uh, yeah, Alien Cosmetics, uh, the hauntingly glamorous palette. They, I've mentioned this, I think, two weeks ago that I just saw the front. Um, and now I also have the inside, although I really dislike the picture that I have here because it, it, it warps the color. So let's see if I can find a better picture. Is this a better picture? Not really. But I at least I can at least see it a little bit better. The f there's a filter on top of this or very, very blue lighting. So it makes it very difficult for me to really see the true colors of the of the shades as I am sitting here. But I can kind of swipe a little bit. Maybe I have a better picture when I'm editing. Um, it looks like a fun palette. Yeah, you have reds, you have greens, you have uh, deeper shades. Um, it's in collaboration with Sydney Nicole Adams. It launches in September, 12 shades. Mm, each pen has a tombstone or a ghost. There will be two shimmers, one matte with glitter and nine mattes. So matte heavy palette and then basically two shimmers. Mm. Uh... Shimmer with a pink shift and a shimmer with a green shift. So they are okay. Yeah. Mm, yeah, it sounds like very pretty shades. If you want to, you can use my affiliate code. It will be listed down below in the description box. Mm, I don't know if I will get it personally, but I do think it looks pretty. I just wish I had a kind of a better picture actually. But that's 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 me. It's coming soon. So I will link um, the site down below. Congratulations on the collab. Um, yeah, I have here a picture of Sydney Nicole and she's gorgeous. Gorgeous. So congratulations and I hope it will be a huge success. And if you want to get your hands on it, well, I will leave it down below. Um, or at least the site because I don't know if it has launched by the time you're seeing this. Mm, what else? Uh, oh yeah, and the lore palette is back. From Alien Cosmetics. Was that... Did I... Or did I mention it last week? I don't remember. Did I mention that the lore palette is also back? Maybe I forgot. But it's... Yeah. Well, that, that was kind of it then. That was it, guys. Uh, I've probably missed stuff. Um, probably... If I did, let me know down in the comment section. I'm still here at the site to give a weekly shout out to my members that you will see scrolling on the screen right now. If you want to become a member, there is a link to join in the description box. And what do you get for being a member? You get a colored raven behind your name. You also get special emojis in live chat and in the description box. And there is a members only video uh, every month that I, as I'm filming this, forgot to film. Because it's the 2nd of September again already. So I will get on that ASAP and it will be online as soon as I can. As soon as I can. That's basically the gist of it. Yes. This was it, guys. Uh, everything will be listed down below in the description box as well. Thank you so, so much for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down in the comment section below. I am going to wish you a fantastic day, a fabulous evening. May your foundation always match your neck. And I will see you super soon in my next one. Oh, And if you want to see me shopping, make sure to check out my vlog channel. That will be listed down below. Yes, I'm going to go now. Bye. Thank you.